Today, the shocking murder of the newly reinstated Detective Jane Kalesa last night uptown. The apocalypse war continuing overseas with no end in sight. In other news, the city is deeply saddened today by the death of Gotham icon Bruce Wayne's ward Richard Grayson, 29. Mr. Grayson valiantly gave his life defending a Gothamite from an armed mugger last night in Midtown. Grayson's longtime family friend, Alfred Pennyworth, reported the murder as attempts to revive Grayson ended in failure. Oh, God. Let it out. Every day, Barb, okay? I'm sure Dick would be here if he could. <laughs> Do you know where he is, Dad? He's visiting a girl. Cory. Coriander. Coriander? I bet her real name is Cilantro. They just changed it to make it sound more European. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If this is gonna work, you gotta slow down. None of this would have happened if I had been faster at that door in the first place. Blaming yourself doesn't change anything. Now focus. Guys, I can't, I can't do it. It's just, it's too hard. You've got your mother's strength in you. I know you can do this. Come on. Gosh, it's, I feel so stupid. It's yeah. like I'm not moving at all. It's slow at first. I could have stopped him. Come on, kid. I taught you, taught you how to walk the first time. I'm gonna teach you how to walk again. Come on, let's do this. Barbara, listen to me. The news Dr. Cross just gave us is unparalleled. We're still here. You can do this. The only way that maniac wins is if we give up. Given our history, I was hoping we could put our differences aside, and... I'm breaking tons of laws being here, so could you just not call your dad? Please? Nice hair, Dinah. It, it is amazing. Thanks. Thanks. Just got to me. We don't know anything for certain. I've been over and over the data, and there's just something missing. The blood was contaminated, and the killer used a high-caliber round. Untraceable. A sniper? The trajectory of the impact from the roof seems to suggest that it was from an elevated position. So it's obvious that someone wanted Dick dead. Kalesa just got in the way. So now what happens? I don't know. I just don't know. You know, you really should warn me if you're going to throw me into harm's way. You told me she was going to get put away, not murdered. Look. 
Whatever happens, we're here for you, okay? Warn me next time! Or what? Don't forget why you joined up, hero. Look, whatever happens, we will get you some ice cream. <laughs> I'm gonna be sorbet instead. Now you're asking for a miracle. Avocado ice cream. Ooh. They make it, I'm pretty oh, sure. I know, they do. I actually tried it and I didn't like Avocado it. I was really cream. disappointed that I didn't like That's it. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Strife, I've had a very long night. I don't have time for your usual dramatics. Detective Collins and I are about to have a meeting. Doors that way, chump. Why don't you let the grown-ups talk? You think you can just lie to me and then walk away? Not this time. Is that whiskey I smell on your breath, Spike? I think it is. Oh, shocking. I would have liked to see Coessa rot behind bars and then die alone, rather than on some roof with some thugs. I think you knew what she had planned with Ivy, with Glenn, and you sent me on a wild goose chase for nothing. Lindsay was right. Come on, Gillian. Time is money. Shut up! How's uh, your girl, Candace? Excuse me? You killed Glenn. That's enough, Detective Strife. You're off the task force and suspended until further notice. Your firearm and your badge. Now. I'm gonna find out what happened. Good luck with that partner. I'm out. Sorry. Lindsay was right. Hey, Julie. Hey, we need to talk. We don't need to do anything. Come on, you're not acting rational about all this. Come on, Julie, please. Will you just hear me out? I've been trying to contact you for the past day because I didn't want you finding out in the news, but Jane Kales is dead. She was assassinated last night by a sniper. What? I know. We don't know if there's any connection with the mob yet. The investigation's ongoing. I just want to be the person to tell you. So how are you? I'm surviving. I haven't seen you since the funeral. I wouldn't know. Are we done here? Jules, come on. You knew that Glenn was cheating on me and you chose not to tell me. It was you who barred Roland from the investigation and you were supposed to throw her in Arkham. No, Julie, see, you don't get it. Logue didn't care about the case. He didn't care whether or not Calloway's murderer was actually found. It was all politics. And you may not believe it, but I actually did what I had to do to protect my friend. We trusted you. You are not the only one who lost someone important that night, Julie. We're done here. Julie, please wait. Hey, listen. You can trust me. Out of everyone in the city, you can trust me. And if you need anything, call me. Goodbye, Lindsay. We don't even know who pulled the trigger, do we, Detective Collins? No, Kamish. We heard it was a sniper. <laughs> a sniper. An expert marksman for what I told you the way he did. Pinpoint accuracy. And where was your man Yaku on that one? He wasn't able to make it to the scene in time to save Kalesa. Oh, really? I called him and he hung up on me. <laughs> That's not protocol, is it, Gil? No. No. I expect to be communicated with properly in situations like that in the future. Detective Collins, watch your tone. Oh, drop the tough girl act. I'm not afraid of you, Candace. You should be. Ladies, ladies, please. Tony. Ah, oh, Tony. Let me get this straight. First off, you sprang out of prison. And even though I was against that, I went with it anyways. Then you had a shot of Falcone, and she gets herself gunned down. By who? You don't even know. And after all that, 
You still want me to trust you? I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm losing faith in you, Tony. Faith. Now is when you start to lose trust in me. You know this nice big house you got? That's because of me. All those nice cars you drive around town, all that muscle you got, your whole way of life. That's because of me. So unless you want all those things to just go away, I suggest you shut the hell up and continue to play ball with us. Because the way I see it right now, Kules ain't the only one who could be sniped. You ought to lie, Tony. Go ahead. Walk away. Walk away, Tony. You're a coward. Don't you ever talk to me like that again, Gillian. You're just a cog in the wheel. I'm not the only one. Secure server connecting now via LexCorp satellite. Welcome, Agent Brooks. Access denied. Access denied. Access denied. Agent Brooks does not have clearance. Nelson, they're lying to you. Just like you lied to me. R Renoa, I have Glass's drive. We need to meet. No, not tomorrow. Tonight. Trust is such a fleeting thing these days. It's our first morning in Co City. Come over here. Corey, I'm not done with you. 